Welcome to Good Taker Lead Code Tutorial. This time we are going to solve a binary tree coding problem, same tree. So given two binary trees, write a function to check if they are same or not. Two binary trees are considered the same if they are structurally identical and the nodes have the same value. So there are three examples. So first example, so there are two binary trees. So the first tree have a root node value with one, second tree with a root value also one. And the, for the first tree, the left child node is value two, right child node is three. And for the second tree, the left child node value is also two, and right child node is also value three. So this output will be true because these two binary tree would be considered as a same tree because they are both structurally same and the each node value are also same. And for the second example, we see the first tree and the second tree, they are also with the same root node value, that's one. And for the first tree, the left child node is value two, but it doesn't have a right child node. But for the third second tree, so the left child node is empty, it doesn't have a left child node, it only have a right child node that's value two. So the output would be four. So we see here, even the left child node is the same value as the second tree's right child node. They are structurally different. So it's like a reverse. So these two trees are not be considered as identical. They are two different tree, so return as a false. And for the third example, we see two trees both with a root low value one, and the first tree it has a left child low value two, right child low value one, and second tree the left child low is value one, the right child low uh, is also the the value two. So these two trees are not be the same. They are different because they, the even the root node value are the same, but the child node value are different. It's just like a reverse tree, so it's a structurally different. So output is a false. So same tree is a basic uh, binary tree coding problem. So let's take a look at how to solve this same tree coding problem. So. Here are some example, like there are two binary trees and uh, with a P and Q indicates a root node for two trees. So here we our goal is to implement this eSIM tree function. eSIM tree function will take these two nodes uh, two nodes as an input and the need to determine based on this uh, structure of the two trees determine whether these two trees are the same. So we can list a, like a um, scenario when the same tree can be returned true. So what are the scenario that the, the same tree function can be returned true? So how does the P and Q would be look like? So first scenario we could have is that when the P and Q, these two root nodes are now. So P is now and Q is also now. So these two trees, the root node, are both now. In that case, actually, it's same tree will return true because it's structurally identical and value are the, are the same. So two binary tree are considered the same if they are structurally identical and nodes have the same value. Based on that, that description, that if the two nodes are null, that's also structurally same and the value are the same. So even that's a null, they are same structure and the same value. So that we found that in that case, if same tree can return true. So for other case, so like if the nodes value are not now, so for P is not now, and Q are also not now. So if P and Q are not now, so they have some value. So we need to have a more condition 
to check if that's a symmetry. So first, we, if that's a symmetry, so p value needs to be same as a cube value. That's one more condition. So in addition to that, we also need to check the left tree of the left child tree for the two nodes and also the right tree for the two nodes. So we need to check. So p dot left and q dot left. So these two nodes, the left child tree should also be the same. So it's same tree for the p left p nodes left subtree and the q nodes left subtree should also be the true. This is the same tree function should also return true. So that means p nodes subtree and the q nodes left subtree are the same. Similarly, that's for the right subtree. So p dot right and q dot right. So the right subtree for the p and right subtree for the q should also be the true. That's one more condition. So if we meet all these four conditions, that we can determine is same tree p and q is a true. And for other scenarios, like we already checked if p and q both are null, p and q are not null. But for other case, simply just return false because uh, that's uh, for other case, it's either structurally are different or the node value are different. So for other case, just uh, simply return false. So this is really straightforward. So we check the first, uh, like uh, no, two nodes are null and two nodes are not null if uh, they need to be same tree, what's a condition. And for other scenario, just return false. Okay, let's go back to Cody to keep solving this problem. So it's same tree. As we just said, if P and Q are both null, in that case, we should return true. They are same tree. Otherwise, like if P is not null and Q is not null, in that case, so we need to check if so here are some conditions. So if the root low value and the second node root node value are the same and their left subtree and right subtree are also same, we can we can return true. So if same tree, so p dot left, q dot left, and is symmetry for the right right node and um, right node so p dot right and q dot right we return true and for other scenario we just simply return false okay so it's really straightforward so let's click submit so it's in processing. Okay, accept it. So it's, we successfully solved this asymmetry coding problem. So as you see, the code is simple. The solution is very straightforward. So we first check if these two nodes are the null. So if both nodes are not returned as true, as a description mentioned, the structure the same, nodes uh, value are the same. And if the two root node value are not null, we need to check whether the root node value are the same and also the left subtree and right subtree are also the same tree. And we return true for that case. For other scenario, just return false. 
because it's either the structurally different or the nose value are different to return false. So you see this uh, same tree is a basic uh, binary tree coding problem, but uh, sometimes it's still being asked uh, at some complex interviews coding problem. So just uh, keep practice and you will be more confident to solve the coding interview problem. So just do that. So that's all about today's uh, uh, coding tutorial. So see you next time.